Hi guys, welcome back to another Kitty and Live tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to split the screen when you have a video. Say you want to have, like, I don't know, four different videos playing. So you want to have video here, video here, and a couple here. Or you could have two. You can do as many as you want. So let's just jump right into that. First, it, you need to create as many tracks as you're going to have videos playing. So I'm going to have four playing, so I only have three tracks here by default when it opens up. I'm going to insert one above there, uh, video three, and we're going to name it video four. So now we have four tracks, and I'm just going to drag my videos in here, and then we will cut them to length. So give me a second to drag all these in here. I'm probably just going to push this one around here because it's kind of short. And we're going to put that there. So now to cut them all to length, at one time you just hit your control key and select each one. You'll see that they've all been selected here. Now you hit your X key to get your scissors or razor tool, and you click, and it will slice them all on the way up. So we're going to select, hit our S for selection tool. I'm going to just hit control select all the cutoffs. Select them all, put them up to the beginning there. And then we're going to cut the ends up and my program just crashed. Oh, Kitty and Live is famous for this. Okay, it recovered it. Oops. Got to select them all again. Put them up to the beginning. Now we're going to cut these, select all our cutoffs here, remove the cutoffs. So now we have these, we just, I want to show you something real quick, what you can do, see we got this top video playing, if you want to hide that, just come over here and click this, you know, hide that, and hide whatever you want, that way it makes it a little bit easier when you're trying to arrange stuff. So you select your track and you right click on it, go to add transition, and then we're going to Compass it, I think it is. Drag it to the track length. I'm going to do the same thing for the next one. Oops, I want to move that. Let's like this. I'm going to drag this to the track length. Let me do that one more time. Okay, now to split up the videos and resize them, we need to go to crop and transform right here. Select the arrow, expand that, and then we need to go to position and zoom. And then we just drag it into each track. Okay, now that we have that done, I am going to resize my videos down to a quarter of the size that I'm doing 4K, so a quarter of it would be 1080. So you punch in the size you want your videos to be. I'm just going to go through and do that to all of them real quick. Okay, now I have all my videos resized. You can either drag them around if you want, but I'm just going to enter the location. So, so this one I'm going to leave up in the top corner, and this one I am going to move over to 1920. So it puts it over here. And then we're going to select the next one, and we are going to put this one at 1080. So it puts it down here. And this last one uh, we need to. 20, so it moves it over here, then we're going to move it down, so we're going to put it 1080. You can drag them around if you want, and I will just play this back so you can see what this looks like. Give me one second. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe. See you guys later. Have any comments, post them below. And if you need any help, I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible.